good morning friends welcome back to my channel and into another weekly grocery haul for you i didn't need a ton of things because we didn't go through all of the dinners that i had for last week's schedule um so i kind of just did a couple things to kind of stock some of the stuff in my pantry so i'm getting ready to share that with you as well as stock back up on lunchbox supplies and back to school items for you know lunchbox supplies um if you are new here welcome to my channel we'd love to have you disregard all the bags back there um and if you are coming back thank you so much uh, I will turn you around and we'll kind of walk through this grocery haul. Um, this is a Walmart grocery pickup. Um, and I did spend $120 and some change. Um, so we're going to turn you guys around. <clears throat> okay, so we'll start down here. Um, we got a case of water. We got a case of root beer. And then we got three cases of Under Armour. Um, I find that my kids prefer the Under Armour drinks over the soda. Um, usually we would get two of those for the like week um, because I let them have a soda at dinner time. But uh, they have been choosing the Under Armours uh, more so. So we have, um, I picked up three of those plus I still have a few of them on hand. Um, so in those Under Armors, you get like, what, eight of them, and they're like five eighty-eight or something. Okay, moving along up here, we have, um, three cans of the family size corn. I had been buying, like, this, the half, like, size of this, so like the 15 or 16 ounce size, but I find that we need just for our family size, just one big can, so I think I'm just going to stock my pantry with um, the big cans instead of the small cans. We didn't necessarily need any corn uh, or green beans, but I went ahead and picked them up um, just to have uh, start stocking my pantry back up. I fully intend on getting my pantry back to its all original glory um, so that I have about three months worth of like different supplies on hand. I don't know what's going on with this light. It's kind of overcast and crap cloudy today. Let me see if I can adjust the light for you guys. Maybe that'll be better. You'll let me know. Um, we got the honey. My dogs, my one dog, my husky, needs honey to take his medicine. Um, so we get the raw honey there. Uh, we pulled out the last jellies out of our pantry. So I just got a strawberry and a grape. And then I picked up this big go-go squeeze uh liam seen these on a commercial and the last time whenever we stocked up for lunchbox supplies he asked me why i didn't get the big ones so i went ahead and obliged him and got the big ones this time we got the uh danimals right here this is the 12 pack this is our life they did give me the wrong flavors so that kind of stinks um, that's not the one that I ordered, so I don't know if my kids are going to drink that banana one or not. We'll see. Um, just to have some macaroni and cheese on hand, I don't really have any plans for this. Um, just to have some on my shelf back there, some ketchup. I pulled the last one of the ketchups too, so I went ahead and stocked those back up. Um, next week when I do grocery haul, I'll probably do the same thing where I'll pick up some more of these items just to put in my pantry. Um, and then I have two of the 2.25 things of hamburger. I'm going to make a meatloaf with one this week. And then the other one, we're going to have tacos and burritos. Um, so that's why those are there. We got some more red grapes. My kids seem to really like these. Um, we have two things of taco shells. Our taco shells, burrito shells. We got a thing of cheddar. Um, I only got the 8 ounce one um, because I had one on hand. So we'll use that one first and then we'll dip into that if we need to. We got a bag of cereal for the pantry. I have two open bags uh, right now in my cabinet. Um, so we'll work through those and then we'll have that one on hand for the pantry. I have two things of the brown sugar hickory baked beans. Um, just for the pantry, I have no plans with that either. 
Uh, we have uh, refried beans and the taco shells. I'm the only one in my house that eats taco shells, but I like tacos. I like burritos too, but I like the tacos as well. I picked up just to put in my freezer two of these uh, frozen already uh, ground beef, and then I picked up a box of these. Um, if you guys haven't tried these, these are really, really good. Um, I highly suggest them. We got these a couple weeks back when we barbecued for Labor Day and they were really, really good. So I'm just going to probably stock up on these. Um, you get six one third pound burgers. This is like a restaurant style burger and I think it was like seven, like 86 about eight bucks for six of them but they are so good and so convenient to have on hand so if you didn't set anything out for dinner um, you can just pull these out turn your grill on and grill them or we've only ever grilled them we've never put them like in a frying pan so um, I don't imagine that you couldn't put them in a frying pan and fry them up but I'm gonna start stocking up on this to have these in my freezer because my family really really enjoyed that in one box of six will feed my whole family um, depending on who's here so sometimes we might need two sometimes we might need one box and one burger from the other box it just depends on who's in my house at the time who's over at my house we have people in and out all the time friends and whatnot you know I have three boys they all have friends over whatnot all the time um, stocked up we're almost we're running low on the Uncrustable so I went ahead and got the big box of those I got some Canadian bacon slices. I figured these would be really good in lunch boxes. Um, so like for um, homemade Lunchables. So I went ahead and picked those up. The work's all done for you and it really wasn't that expensive. They're like two bucks or something. I got the big pack of string cheese. This is like a, one of the staples in my house. Um, I have been just buying the smaller pack that's got like maybe 12 or 20 of them in there. Um, but that seems to not last me through the week. So this is the big 24 pack. I really wanted, they have a 36 or a 32 pack. And I really wanted that one. However, the store was out. Um, so I just got one of these and then of course the sugar-free jello my kids really uh, Enjoy these as well um, And I don't mind to let them have it because it's sugar-free and they don't even know the difference They don't even know that sugar-free um, I got two things of bread here And of course you guys know that this is life for my husband um, We got a big bag of Doritos for Doritos and cream cheese. We got some milk um, and then over here, my, my sons have been asking me for smoothies for a while. Um, and I just never have, I didn't have any like frozen berries and stuff on hand. Uh, so we went ahead and picked up the berry medley and then the banana and strawberry blend. Uh, so we can make smoothies. We got, uh, somebody in the house, actually two people in the house that's got, uh, a sore throat right now um, and so the little guy my husband has a sore throat and he's all snotty and congesting it's turning fall here in Missouri and that's never a good thing for anybody okay that has allergies it's not a good pleasant feeling to live in Missouri during that time um, uh, fortunately for me, I don't really have too much allergies. Every once in a while, I do, um, but usually not too bad. Um, and mine's usually before, like, the season, the time before, in between fall and winter is usually whenever it starts for me. Anyway, the little guy, he won't eat, like, the menthol, uh, cough drops. So we got these. Maybe he will be okay with eating those. Um, and then my husband seems to think he needs a multivitamin. Um, and so he picked up these one a day Vitacraves men's gummies. Now, my husband is not a big, like, medicine person. So I'm surprised that he wanted a multivitamin, but whatever. I got this ginormous pack of index cards so that we can work with Liam on his spelling words. Um, and you know sight words and things like that. I like to make flashcards for him. He seems to do a lot better with um, Learning his words 
if he can just do them over and over and over and over again. Um, we got a 12 pack of uh, sweets, treats for the lunchbox. Um, I don't know how this made it in my cart, uh, but it did. And then we got peanut butter uh, Ritz crackers. My husband eats those all the time. We got some a box of the Cheez-Its, and of course I've already told you about that. So overall, um, not the biggest haul that I've ever done. Certainly not the smallest one, but we have like a uh, baked ziti on the um, menu for this week to make. I already have all that stuff on hand, and we're having like steamed vegetables and Polish sausage. I already have all that stuff on hand because I have a garden. Um, and so really the only thing that we have here is the meatloaf. Um, we're having mashed potatoes with that, and I already have potatoes in my basket, also because I have a garden. Um, and the burritos and tacos, you guys seen that I have that stuff here. Um, I didn't get lettuce or tomatoes because I also have a garden and I have that stuff on hand. So, um, that is all for today. Um, I am going to be doing a restock my pantry. If you guys are into those type of videos, um, then do keep an eye out. They'll be coming out at some point this weekend. Um, I also have uh, some organizational videos coming out. One for my fridge, one for my pantry. Um, and then I might put those up first before the restock video, but... Just know that I'm going to be uh, filming a restock video of my pantry, the way that I store and get all of this stuff ready. Um, I prep all of my fruits and vegetables. You see that I only have grapes here, but I had gone to the farmer's market and I have like blackberries, raspberries, all that stuff um, already in my refrigerator from going to the farmer's market. So I didn't buy a ton of fruit. Apples I got at the farmer's market. So, um, if you're interested in watching me get prepped for the week ahead, um, it just uh, tremendously saves me so much time when I do that. Um, so, if you are interested in that kind of video, do stick around. I will be posting those every couple of weeks when I need to restock my pantry. Um, other than that, I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. Um, by the time you see this video, it'll be Monday probably. So... Uh, have a fantastic weekend coming up after you watch this video. Um, I hope you guys had a great uh, day today and I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, give yourself a little bit of grace. If you don't get all of the things at the store, don't worry. It's going to be okay um, and just make do with what you got. Alright guys, have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye.